<sighs> another day, another job. Good morning, Thomas. Good morning, Sandy. I'll go make breakfast. Okay, I'll just go take a nap. Waking eggy eggs and bacon! Ah! Sir! I, you you clearly see I'm taking a nap right now, right? Yeah. It's only six o'clock in the morning. What's going on? Look, Thomas, you gotta wake up. You gotta train today. Well, can I at least get my kids ready for school first? Fine, you got 10 minutes. Meet me at the docks. Is Cranky there? Cranky? Psh, the last episode he was in was episode 19. He got cranked away because he was being a jerk to the bigger engines. Not to mention that he almost killed you, Percy and Nia. When? Remember episode 14 of season 1 when he teamed up with James, Gordon, and the others? Oh, okay. Then let me go get my kids. Alright, you do that. Alright, Winston, let's go to the docks. Hey, Sandy. Yeah? Are you gonna wake up the kids? Yeah, that's what I was gonna do anyway. Okay. Happy Mother's Day, Mommy! But it's only the 13th of May. I know. We were kind of late. We spent all night on this. Well, what's this? It's a car we painted. We painted it in red, blue, and yellow. Your three favorite colors. And the primary ones. Red, yellow, and blue. Red, yellow, and blue. That's the song I remembered when I was a kid. Yeah, we know that, Dad. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. You two go get dressed. I'll go make the breakfast. <sighs> Bye, Mommy. Well, what day is it, Dad? Monday. Monday? Are you serious? Yep, Monday. Get up. Well, you guys are already up. So I guess school starts in two hours. But that's not enough time. 15 minutes late, and there goes your computer. <gasps> Not my precious computer. Shh. He didn't mean it. Ew. Yeah. That's kind of weird. Well, then put your clothes on. But we don't wear any clothes. Oh, well, anyways, time to go to school, Thomas Jr. How come she doesn't? Because she's four. But she came out a mom three episodes ago. Well, Thomas Jr., I don't make the rules of the show. I just follow them. Your breakfasts are on the table. Let's go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh -huh. I love bacon and grapes. I know you do. Now let's go. All right, everybody, I repeat, a pair a huge and scrumptious breakfast. Yeah, right. These aren't toaster strudels. They're dog treats. Trying to feed us dog treats? Yeah, woman, what kind of stuff you be watching on the Internet? Why humans should eat dog treats? No, 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 no. They're not for us. They're for the dogs. Then why did you say so? Feeding dogs from the table is my specialty. Here, boy. Here you go. Oh, good boy. Hey, that's mine. That's mine. Give it back. All right, here you go. Feeding you like a bird and some, you know, bread. Bird and bread. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. All right, let me get back to the table. Mommy, my bacon is too small. Girl, all I gotta say is you better eat that bacon. Your mother worked 17 hours a week putting that food on this table. On, I gotta say, you, you better eat it right now before I smack the green out of your silly butt. Okay, as I was saying, all of you say your pro. <laughs> Oh, 
What you said, honey? I said you guys didn't even say your prayers yet. Well, look at the time. It's nine o'clock. See you at the work, honey. Wait, okay, everybody, give me your plates. All right, here's mine, Mom. Here's mine. All right, guys, uh, we'll be back in some hours. All right, Thomas Jr., you go to school while I go to work. But we're both, we're both 16 to 17 year olds. Aren't we both supposed to go to school? Oh, yeah, we all have to go to school. Oh, well. The school every five weeks, so whatever. All right, let's go, Thomas Jr. Yay! Well, Tiffany, I guess it's just you and me. Oh, well, 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 look who shows up. Hey, Thomas, how's the kids? Hey, Percy, they're fine. It's just that I don't want to do this train. Well, we're doing it together. What? Sir Topham Hat didn't tell you? The fir do the first half. I'll do the rest. Where is it? Over there. No thanks, Percy. I'ma do all of it. If you, don't you, wait. Don't you got mail duty? Don't do that till after lunch break at one. Oh, okay then. Well, I'ma take this, and I'ma see you later. All right, purse, see you later. But Thomas didn't listen to Percy. Instead, he left and went to Wellsworth Station. Huh? What's this? Wellsworth or 13 Killer Pond? Well, not pond, but pond. Well, I guess I'll take my chances. So off Thomas went. Huh, this is, this is really, really strange. Ah, what the heck is that? <laughs> Thomas flew to the shunting yard, to Nafford, to the sheds, and back to Brandon Dock. I think it's chasing me. <sighs> okay, I think it's gone. I think it's gone. Oh, Thomas, you're just in time. I was about to take Annie and Clarabelle. Don't what so ever. Okay, deal, deal. Well, okay. Anyways, I saw something come out of the pond. See, that's what I was trying to tell you. Not to go there. Every Friday the 13th. Gee, it sure is boring around here. As I was saying, boring. Ow, Percy, why did you do that? Because... You didn't listen to my story. Anyways, Friday the 13th is considered an unlucky day in Western superstition. It occurs when the 13th day of the month in the Jajorian calendar falls on a Friday, which happens at least once every year, but can occur up to three times in the same year. For example, 2015 had a Friday the 13th. In 2022 of this month, AKA May, there's only one occur, which is this year. Okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. So what? What on earth is going on here? You two should be at work. I'm teaching Thomas Friday the 13th, which is today. Today? 
I saw Jigsaw with an AK-47 and everything. With the mask? Everything. What should we do? We should go out at night. At night? Thomas, are you insane? Well, that's the best we could do. But he's going to kill everybody. That goes even an inch away from him. Your face chopped off. Well, it's the, it's the only way you two have the day and night off. I suggest you two should get some rest. Okay. So off Thomas and Percy went to go to sleep. Four hours later. You're home early. Me, Percy, and Sir Topham Hat are going to hunt for Jigsaw. Well, be careful, Thomas. We got two kids, plus me. Please be okay. It's gonna be fine when the kids come home. They're upstairs. Well, time to say go goodbye to the kids. All right, Tiffany. Are you ready to see the dark web? The dark web? Yeah, it's where you can buy illegal things. Buy illegal things? But what if we get caught? Psh, we're not gonna get caught. Hey, kids. Hi, Dad. Why are you home early? Well, I'm gonna go on a Friday the 13th hunt for Jigsaw. Cool, can I come? It might be too scary for you. Well, I'm not scared of anything. All right, let, let's go. And Tiffany, I want you to have something. Like, like what? This. Hey, that's mine. We're going to die later today, so what's the point? Oh, yeah. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late. Thomas, why did you bring Thomas Jr. along? This is supposed to be a four guys mission, not a five guys mission. Hey, if Catherine Jackson stopped giving birth to babies, the Jackson 5 would be the Jackson 3 or the Jackson 2. Oh, okay then. How many lines do you have, Winston? Four. That sucks. Here he comes. Oh, heck yeah. What are we going to do now, Dad? I don't know. Did anyone call the cops? Yep, doing it right now. Uh-oh, he noticed us. Run! Thomas, Percy, Thomas's kid, go without me. Well, they won't miss you. Shing! Well, never mind. Told you. Sorry, playing Sonic 1. Yes, yes, now jump. Thomas Jr., you you know better not to snatch stuff away from people. Sorry, Dad, but it's f at this time of night, I think I should. 911, what's your emergency? Hey, this is Thomas Jr. with Percy and Thomas. There is a crazy maniac chasing us. And he killed two-fifths of our group? You don't say. Which way are you going? Wellsworth Station. I'll be on my way. Bye. Boo, boo, boo. What did he say? On his way. Quick, 
to Wellsworth Station. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Ah! Oh no, it's a dead end. You got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> now, there's nowhere left for you to run, and I'm gonna kill you. Just like nobody helped me when I drowned in the water, and nobody's gonna help or save you. You do realize we got a phone, right? Well, <laughs> Hey, that cost him 300 bucks. Whatever. You won't get it back after I'm done with ya. You're under arrest. Wait, what? You're under arrest for committing murder and theft. Theft? What are you talking about? Apparently, he stole a kitchen knife 10 years ago. Oh, I thought this was a butcher's knife. It's clearly not. Now, let's see who this guy really is. Yeah. Oh, I want to stick around for this. Isn't this like a Scooby-Doo moment? Oh, yeah, it is. <gasps> Israel Keys? Yes, it is me, Israel Keys. I escaped jail nearly 10 years ago. But why? You see, after this this ten year old moron thought that that you were supposed to take dimes in a gumball machine, and I broke it and then tried to give him the dime. Apparently, he called the cops on me. He tricked me. I mean, it's true. He did kill three people. Yeah, that's true. And it's about to be you all. Just get to the plot. Okay, yes, it is me. After I went to jail, then I sneaked out. I pulled the fire alarm. Huh, <sighs> classic. No, right? Anyways, I sneaked out. Then I, I got my revenge. I went to somebody's house. I broke in, and then I killed them. Apparently, they had a dog, too, so I, I, get, I kept them. His name is Obi. He's really cute. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and then I took their kitchen knife, and then I got my revenge, and you'll never get ahead of me. Yeah, okay, back to the slammer you go. You three have a good day. Sorry for this nonsense. It's already 11 o'clock at night. Hmm, time must have fly by fast. It does when you kill people. I'm gonna get my revenge. You'll wait and see. Yeah, whatever. You too! Okay, Thomas Jr., let's go. I'm going home too. See you tomorrow, Thomas. See ya. Dun 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 dun. Hey guys, Justin here. Sorry the camera was a little bit shaky in certain parts of this episode. This episode was supposed to come out last week, and it's crazy. And the script? right here was done like go like one week before you know what make it two weeks before yeah crazy so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this episode right now track master thomas and friends is on a hiatus and won't get another episode till july which is thomas gets a job so i'll see you guys later bye